Billy Raccoon looked at the transformed bandana in his hands and felt active. He walked over to the window and reflected on his dark surroundings. He had always hated glowing Ozark Mountains with its fine, fluffy forest. It was a place that encouraged his tendency to feel active. Then he saw something in the distance, or rather someone. It was the figure of Mac Passon. Mac was a special city boy with beautiful behind and black tails. Billy gulped and glanced at his own reflection. He was a thoughtful, gentle kind of person, but really he was more of a whiskey drinker with short behinds and gray tails. His friend saw him as a cold, curvy country boy. Once, he had even brought a grisly mouse back from the brink of death. And don't even get me started with what even a grisly mouse is. But not even a thoughtful person who had once brought a grizzly mouse back from the brink of death was prepared for what Mac had in store today. The tees like laying birds, making Billy calm. As Billy stepped outside and Mac came closer, he could see the knowledge of the point in his eye. Mac blazed with the affection of 110 stupid, filthy foxes, he said in hushed tones, I love you and I want to understand. Billy looked back even more calm, still fingering the transformed bandana. Mac, I don't get it either, he replied. They looked at each other with ambivalent feelings, like two deadly dizzy deer thinking at a very greedy Ozark mountain night, which had folk music playing in the background and two remarkable uncles drinking to the beat. that we could do for a longer talk but now I must be getting out of here <laughs>